This question is from the 2017 Unit 2 uh, AS Physics exam paper. It's a question on waves. The first thing these guys want me to do is to, to calculate um, the distance a wave will travel in a certain amount of time. So if I have a look at this diagram here, I've got one, two and a half waves on it. So the uh, total distance, 0 0.50, divided by the number of waves, that's two and a half, is equal to 0 0.20 meters. Now that's the wavelength, uh, or lambda, okay? So the wavelength of this wave. I can do velocity equals distance over time to find how, um, how fast the wave is traveling, because I now know the distance of 0 0.2, that's this one here, and up here in the question, it tells me the amount of time one wave takes to happen. So that's 0 0.04, and that's equal to five meters per second. And then I can do um, distance is equal to speed times time. So I can do distance is equal to five times this one from within the question. That's the time the wave's being given to travel. And that's gonna give me 1.7 meters. The next bit is to sketch on this graph here, or this diagram here, um, what a wave will look like after 0.34 seconds. So if I take 0.34 and divide it by 0.04, I get 8.5. Now the fact is 8.5 doesn't really matter. The important bit is the 0.5 bit. It's telling me that this wave is... Um, that the cycle has taken place eight and a half times. So the wave will look subtly different after half. And it will look like this. It will be in exactly the opposite condition that it was before. Now, the exam board wants me to have roughly the same amplitude. Now, my drawings are terrible. But if I looked at that, I'd understand that this student, or myself in this case, kind of thinks it's going to look the same, but be opposite to each other. Now my next question, we've got a little bit of recall here. So um, what is meant by a node? So a uh, node is no oscillation. There's no movement at that point on the wave. And how far apart will the nodes be? Well, we get them every half a wavelength. But on this stationary wave, what is half a wavelength? So 0.2, that's my wavelength from up here, divided by 2 is equal to 0.1 meters apart. And then it says, state how, if at all, the phase of the oscillations of the particles in the string vary. Well, um, so in, so, so we'll start with out of phase at the nodes, becoming more in phase, sounds bad language, doesn't it? More in phase until anti-node reached and then back to out the next node. Okay, so a little bit of recall there, a little bit of explanation of what we understand. Okay, so uh, the final bit of this particular question wants us to, to uh, explain in terms of interference why we get this um, wave produced on a string. So um, the wave is reflected and this wave interferes constructively and destructively with anti nodes and nodes. Okay, and then lastly, stationary waves may be observed on the string. One way, apart from different frequency, in which the stationary waves will be different from the original string. If, um, if we change the frequency, so we increase the frequency. Uh, there's actually three ways we can do this, and they kind of mean the same thing. So the nodes will get closer together, 
Um, or you could say um, the wavelength will get less. Or you can say more nodes on the string. Hope that was nice and useful for you, and uh, I'll see you again soon.